Hey, welcome back to Hostess Coach. I just thought we would go live today. I know everyone's probably getting ready to go to a party. Well, so are we. And we are going to be bringing these sausage jalapeno uh, balls that are looked so good. They came up. I had a totally different plan for what I was going to bring to the Super Bowl party today. But this came up on my feed this morning, and I thought, you know what? That's what I'm making. So let's get started. I'm going to pull the mixer in here. We're going to get started with one um, block of softened cream cheese. Let's get that in. And I'm going to give that a little mix because it's so dense. Let's start and give that a little mix. Oh my gosh. Yum! Okay, and then to that, we are going to add a pound of our favorite, Jimmy Dean Hot. You can use what you like, but we love Jimmy Dean hot around here. Move my blade out, out, out of the way. So in goes a pound of Jimmy Dean. Oh my gosh, smells good already. <laughs> and to that, I'm gonna add, this is about, this is one, I'll tell you what it is, one whole jalapeno, diced small, and about a little less than half of a cup of the pickled jalapenos, you know, the ones that come in the jar like this. Um, a little bit less than half a cup because I wanted to add real jalape jalapeno too. So this is going in. Okay, jalapenos in. I'm gonna add one package of bacon cooked. So you can see I've got a package of bacon. I just cooked it and chopped it up. And that's going in. Cause you know, one kind of pork is good, but two kind of pork, is, two kinds of pork is even better. So in goes, I have a cup and a half here. I'm actually using gluten-free baking mix, um, but you can use whatever you like. You can use that cheddar biscuit mix, Bisquick, you know, baking mix. I'm using gluten-free baking mix, but anything would work in, in this re uh, recipe. I have a cup of grated extra sharp cheddar cheese and a cup of jack cheese going in. You can use Mexican blend, whatever, but you know, we always, Grate our own cheese around here because it just melts creamier and nicer than packaged cheese. Okay, the cheese is in. I'm gonna add one teaspoon of garlic powder. I normally would use real, but I don't want these to be too strong with the garlic. And we'll give that a mix. Here we go. Yum! Who doesn't love jalapeno poppers? Especially for a Super Bowl party, right? Yum. What's your favorite Super Bowl food, huh? I know, jalapeno poppers is right on uh, up there. I would guess chicken wings, jalapeno poppers, queso. Of course, I make a killer que uh, queso. Scroll back on the videos, I've got one that's killer. And it's so good. Okay, and that's that. We have our mixture all mixed up there. So let's make some balls. So to this, let me get my blade out, get the sausage off our blade. Oh my gosh, this smells so good already. This is gonna be yummy. Kitchen's gonna smell great here in a minute. Okay, get that out of the way. I'm using a scoop. I'm gonna move this back so we can scoop here. Okay, here we go. Move this back. I'm just gonna start scooping balls. There we go. Now, another reason to use a scoop is your balls then are all the same size. They're uniform, so they will cook the same amount of time and you won't have some done and some half done. So we're gonna stick this in <clears throat> the oven um, until these reach 165, so about 20 minutes in a 350, 375 oven. You could also do these on your barbecue or your smoker. Would be delicious too. So if you've got your barbecue on and go and go on and going anyway, you can throw these in, uh, in there too. <coughs> Yum. So to this, I will keep sco uh, scooping here, but I'm gonna, just gonna show you just for the sake of time here. I'm gonna take, I just got some pepper steak mix out of the bin at the bulk bin and i'm going to sprinkle some of this steak pepper spice 
use your fa your favorite, whatever's your favorite mix. You make your own. Sometimes I make my own too. Just gonna give them a sprinkle and boom, that's it. In the oven that they go, 20 minutes, they're gonna be delicious. And look, I'm gonna take them to the party in this cute basket. Cause you know, it's not just Super Bowl, but it's Valentine's too this week. So I made a cute little Valentine's basket to serve them in. And that's it. Jalapeno popper sausage balls, delicious. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on Hostess Coach.